cool place. Lots of cool guys, anyway. Surfers and stuff. Surfers are, like, totally cool. <laughs> nah, just hanging out with my brother. You know, going to the beach, messing around. <laughs> Not that kind of messing around. <laughs> Well, what's got you in such a good mood this morning? I can't get through to my house. I left some papers there and I keep comments on the phone. Well, at least you know where she is. Yeah. <clears throat> but living with her can be a bit of a headache. I, I hadn't noticed that photograph there before. Well, I just, I just put it up this morning. It's nice. It's relaxing. I've been thinking about those mountains. Dreaming about him, actually. Well, I hope you're not planning to go back to those mountains right in the middle of starting a business here. No, no. But there is something there. Something that keeps pulling at me. I was hoping you'd take me swimming today. You know where it is. Come on, Kim. You know I'm not strong enough to do it by myself. You were strong enough to break into my footlocker. I apologize for that. Oh, that's right. I forgot. That makes everything okay. You come from that part of society that thinks it's fine to stomp on somebody's privacy. As long as you say you're sorry afterwards. I was wrong to have done it if I knew it was going to upset you. You would have done it anyway. You're just the kind of person who uh, can't control their curiosity. I would have controlled it if I known you would have been so upset with me. You locked me in the cabin. You scared me to death. I didn't lock you in the cabin. I locked myself out. Mm -hmm. 